Hey guys, today I'll show you how you can customize your login and registration page. I'll show you three plugins which are awesome for different things so you can choose for yourself which one will be the best for you. However, these plugins are just for modifying your login page. If you want your content to be visible only for your registered users, you want them to pay for this and things like that, check out the video I've made on membership plugins by clicking here. Now let me show you the plugins for today. The first plugin is called Register Plus Redux and you can make a pretty long form with a lot of fields like this one here or you can make it really short and simple like the one I have made. This plugin is more focused on the backend options but it still gives you a lot of freedom for the frontend options because you can customize pretty much everything with the custom CSS. Here are the settings for the plugin. You can submit your logo here and let's say a few words for every option here. Email verification is if you want your visitors to verify their email before they are registered. Admin verification. Now if you choose these options, you have to approve every new member of your website. Grace period, registration, redirect. This is pretty nice. Uh, you can choose here your thank you page for example or something like that. By default, after successful registration, people are seeing this screen. You can customize this and choose whatever URL you want, just pasting it here. You can choose the option to auto log in a user after registration. Now about the registration form, you have plenty of options here. You can disable the username field and use the email as username. So it will be something like this. If you check the confirm email, your visitors will have to submit their email address twice in order to reduce the misspelling possibility. And here are the fields which could be shown on the registration page. And you can make them just show or you can make them required. You can enable the option for your users to set their own password because by default WordPress are sending them password. Invitation code will be another nice feature for some of you if you're trying to build a closed community or something like that. Here you can customize your disclaimer, license agreement and privacy policy. Here you can customize the style rules and you can create additional fields right here. With this plugin you can also customize the email your visitors will receive after successful registration. You can customize the whole email right here. You can type whatever you want. And here is the most powerful part of this plugin. You can customize your CSS for your register page and your login page which is pretty nice. I have inserted here some code to make the button a little bit bigger. And pretty much that's it. This plugin is great for those who can customize their CSS and want a lot of options for their backhand. The second plugin is called A5 Custom Login Page. It is more focused on easy visual setup of your login page. Another useful feature it has is the login widget which looks something like this and it's so customizable you can insert an image below it and everything so let's go to the setup so you can see what you can do with it first let's customize the login and register page in the general options you can customize the logged out and error messages and import and export settings in the advanced options you can choose to display the block header and the block footer and if you do this your login page will look as part of your website, not as a completely different page. However, even if you don't do this, you have a lot of options to customize the default login page for WordPress, like for example, adding a background. In the logo tab, you can customize your logo with different CSS rules and stylings. Now I remove the background image so I can show you the options for the login container. Again you can insert an image here, let's insert the same image actually and see what's happening. So as you can see the image is right here. Now obviously this is not the right image for this place but I just wanted to show you what you can control. In the login form tab you can again choose a background image. And you can set the transparency, so let's tap it 75% and see what's happening. So the login form is a little bit transparent now. In the messages and input fields you can customize the text colors, background colors and things like that. 
and in the links you can customize the colors, the hover colors, shadows for all links in this page. You also have the ability to write a custom CSS code here and an additional HTML code. Now let me show you how to configure the widget. Nice thing here is that you can just copy the settings from the login page with just one click and pretty much you can do the same things here. Then go to appearance widgets and drag and drop the A5 custom login to your widget. You can choose where you want it to appear or you can mark it all. Click save and that's it. So pretty much that's the A5 login page. It's based on easy visual editing on your login page but you have no control over the fields. And the third plugin I want to show you here is pretty straightforward. It's called WP Sliding Login Register Panel. And pretty much what it does is just adding this thing right here on your website where your visitors can log in or register. And it's not full of features, just two options here. So pretty much that's it for this video. If, if you're searching for a plugin which allows you easily to edit the visual components of your login page, go with the A5 custom login. If you want more field and you can edit the visual components with CSS, go to the register plus Redex. And if you just want a nice slider for login and registration, go with WP sliding login. Thank you guys for watching. Please thumbs up this video and subscribe for our channel for more videos like this one. Also, if you're still not a member of our WP Lightbulb course, make sure you check it out because I'm sharing my knowledge on how to start doubling your income from your WordPress website and it's absolutely free so you have nothing to lose. So see you there guys. Go to wplightbulb.com course or click in the center of this video now.